Welcome back sports fans. Well, it is a dream come true for many football players across the Peach State to get an offer from head coach Kirby Smart to play D1 college football for the University of Georgia. Well, for one signal caller in the international city, he didn't have to wait till high school to get that call. Antoine Hill Jr. comes from a family rich in football tradition. His father Antoine Sr. played for Macon County High School and won a state championship in 1996. His uncle Derek played college ball at Valdosta State, winning a national title for the Blazers. And his uncle Trey Hill is an all-SEC offensive lineman for UGA. And now AJ is next in line to follow in their footsteps. I was excited. I didn't even believe it at first, really, when he uh, had called. When he called, I thought he was just calling to say something about Trey or something. But then he was like, now nah, I'm calling about Antoine to extend an offer to him anytime he want to come to a game, you know, let us know. We'll get him on the list, and he just a priority for us. Just this past August, Antoine Jr. received a bit of surprising news. He got an offer from the University of Georgia to play college football as part of the class of 2025. Now you do the math. That's right. Antoine is just 13 years old and an eighth grader at Mossy Creek Middle School. We, we know all the hard work we put in, you know, waking up 5 o'clock in the morning, uh, going to camps, um, getting off of work, not even getting sleep to go back to work the next night, stuff like that. I mean, it is what you put in it. You got to put in work yourself. You can't just expect the coach to do everything. You actually have to get up and grind just like your child has to grind. Unlike his dad and uncles, Junior doesn't play in the trenches. Instead, he is a six foot three pro style quarterback who is continuing to grow and develop under center. And although Antoine still has time before he's playing between the hedges or even on football Friday nights, the talented phenom says he still has work to do. Just getting bigger, faster, stronger, um, being able to read coverages, everything. Um, just learning more about the game of football, just like stuff like that. And the best is yet to come. Now the last time AJ was on the football field was back in October when he helped lead his Mossy Creek teammates to an eighth grade county championship. Since then, he's been able to heal and relax a little bit from some of the injuries that happened to him early in the season. But right now, he's actually getting ready to play in a couple of all-star games during the holiday break. But he says when he gets ready to play football in the spring for high school, He's looking forward to being a Houston County Bear. In Warner Robins, Marvin James, 13 WMAZ, Sports.